raise a glass with friends and family. Thursday, May 25th is National Wine Day. It's sister holiday, National Drink Wine Day, falls February 18th of next year. Just so you're prepared. Have a glass of Chardonnay and enjoy these factoids. Italy and France were first and second in producing the most wine, with Spain coming in third. The U.S., however, was tops in total consumption. Don't overdo it while celebrating National Wine Day. Because it's not the sulfides that may give you a headache. Headaches are usually caused by dehydration. Tannins, a compound found in grapes, sugar, which leads to dehydration and hangovers. And lastly histamines. If you spill red wine during your celebration of this day, there is a way to salvage your clothing. According to vinipair.com, blot, not rub, the stain immediately. Soak the stain in cool water, which will prevent the stain from setting. Next, cover the stain in salt until you can't see it. Kosher salt works best. When the salt turns pink, then dries and cakes, remove it. Rinse the stain in hot water, then run it through the laundry as normal. If that doesn't work, some people soak the stain for an hour using one part vinegar and two parts water before running it through the laundry. Some wine facts from wine tours of the world. One acre of grapevines produces five tons of grapes, which equals 3,985 bottles of wine. One barrel of wine produces 24.6 cases of wine, which is 1,180 glasses of wine. One case of wine is made from 30 pounds of grapes and turns into 12 bottles of wine, which is 48 glasses of wine. One bottle of wine is made from 2.4 pounds of grapes and is about 4 to 5 glasses of wine, a glass being 4 ounces.